gynecomastia is an overdevelopment of male breast tissue. It does happen due to many, many reasons. We are specialized in treating the cosmetic part of it. So if you feel that it is overdeveloped visually and it bothers you, we can perform a minor procedure, can be done under local anesthesia or can be done under general anesthesia. Uh, take a part of the fat and part of the gland to flatten the chest and show you a more masculine results, more masculine chest. We perform a liposuction and the gland excision at the same procedure. Uh, I think having a liposuction will help improve the results as we find that removing the gland on its own could lead to inverted nipple and also it, it flattens most of the chest rather than just to flatten or the part behind the nipple areola uh, complex. After the, uh, the gynecomastia procedure, you need to wear a tight garment for about two to three weeks. You can go back to work after two to three days uh, and go back to the gym after two to three weeks. We will remove most of the gland. We will, leave, we will leave behind a very small piece of the gland for the nipple to sit on to prevent inverted nipple. Uh, but it's highly unlikely, highly unlikely that the gland will return uh, and the results will be permanent. Two to three weeks after the procedure, you can go back to do a, a light exercise, but to do a strenuous, a more strenuous exercise, weightlifting, it will need about a month after the procedure. Liposuction and gland excision done in the clinic under local anesthesia or in day surgery under full anesthesia usually will take about one to one and a half hour, let's say between one and two hours.